All right, so today on Gran Turismo 7, I'm going to be doing Daily Race B. So yeah, let's see how this goes. As you can see, I've just entered the warm-up period. And I've just entered the track so we can practice a bit. My record's 145.4. I am like a D-rate racer, so the lobby's going to be interesting because there's a lot of people who like ram into each other. There's some who are just really good and people who super move up. And there's people like me and just looks kind of uh, they're, they're all right racing to be honest, but they're like not crazy good for their rating. Try and break really late here. There we go, I kind of skidded a bit there though. Might have lost a bit of time. Oh, uh, traction control is on four, so that might be bad. Oh, I almost crashed twice then. How lucky am I? I think this will be a record lap, but we'll see. Maybe. I wasn't playing there for a second and I wasn't to be fair. I thought my uh, game audio was a bit louder than usual, but it's pretty average, so. It's good. Alright. I think I'm better at the start of the race than the last part of the race up here. Just because, um. This last bit, I, I don't know. Oh, it's going to be close. Like a second off. Okay. Oh, I'm ahead of myself. Minus zero point zero zero eight. Oh, that is such a good head start. Okay. Going up again, yes. I need like at least a point six second, maybe. Oh gosh, that was awful. No, I hit the wall. Okay, this ain't good. This is not good. Luckily, I've done a few of these races, so my circuit experience isn't terrible, but it's not great either. But if I like the track well enough, and I like the car, then it should be good. I feel like this car is like really good turning though. I don't know, I might be completely wrong. Please, have a good exit. Yes, okay. Oh, I might be able to cut it. I need 0.6 and then I just need to hold it off. Anything on top that would be that much appreciated. Oh, that was not... Oh, no, maybe. Maybe. I don't think this is going to be enough, is it? Oh, 0 0.032 seconds off. That gaining, and the gaining time, it's like 0.2 seconds behind. Okay. Does that crash? Oh, I probably should have bra braked there a little bit. That's even a word. Matchmaking is another 9 minutes. Turn, turn, turn. Okay. 0.3 seconds ahead, but I'm losing time now. I need that arrow to be blue. Blue triangle facing up. This bit's pretty easy. I just messed that up then. There we go. I 
I'm sort of fabbing the accelerator there. Trying to stay in the kilometers of that. I'm losing time, no. Being caught up to myself. Oh my gosh, that exit might have just done it. That might have just done it. Maybe. That might have just done it. That exit. Oh, that exit was clutch. I did it. Okay. 145.1. myself again. I might be, but it's probably going to phase out of extra time. I'm probably going to be caught up. Ooh. I thought that exit was quite smooth, but I know. Oh, I, I had blue. I was gaining then. And it just phased out. That seriously helped me. There's no way bashing into the side to help me there. Oh my gosh. I might start losing again. Okay, right. So I beat my record once. I could probably at my best go like... I feel like a 144 like in the, in the late part of that is difficult. But... Oh, that was way too wide there. I need like a ghost or something to be like putting things back in the head or... Somewhere around there. Am I gaining? No. Okay. Now I'm going to have to do two more laps after this. Two more laps. Okay, I'm still losing. You know what, actually, just so I don't forget, I might put the traction control one layer. I'm doing it very slowly just to make sure I don't like mess up everything. Traction control free. There we go. Alright. Didn't this make you a little bit faster? We need about 140 miles an hour at the finish line when the lap starts. Should be able to get at least two laps and maybe three of them would but okay here's the first traction control three uh what's it called lap i'll just focus on them should make corners a bit easier as well okay i need to try to stick to like the edges of the, the circuit I wonder if you could stay over 100 miles an hour. And that corner there. I went to 99. It's got to be doable. Oh, I feel like once I go below like 2 or 1 TCS, that's just like. Well, that's like the really good drivers to do that. Approaching here, like 111, I think. That's a decent corner. That was an okay uh, penalty thing. Hopefully, when I cross that in the real race, I don't have any problems. Go. On. Oh my gosh, I beat it, okay. Let's see how it is. I accelerated a little bit there, it's probably a bit risky doing that, but it somehow worked. Let 
losing time. No! I mean, I'm ahead, but I am. Um... I did 102 miles an hour going on there. Okay, that might have helped the run. That was a very wide exit, oh god. I'm just starting 2.50, so I need to be back by 1.45, so I'm a minute from now, which I should just about be able to do. Lap, how bad it goes, I still think I'll be able to see. I've just got to hold accelerate and hope I don't fly off the track. I'm not going to beat this by a tiny bit, am I? It'll be like 9.78 or something. 9.73. Oh, that's the other one. track then. Minus 0.4 seconds ahead. That was a decent turn. Oh no, that was such a good one as well. Okay, I'm on a comeback though. Even though I just hold this point one second in which I seem to not be but that could be big. That corner felt so good. How? How is that slower? There's no way that's slower. I could have it. go back before I make it, or is it? Oh yes, okay, it's getting, it's going down in smaller increments. Yes. 144.872, I'm my uncle to it. Okay. Well, you can do this. I can just ease it around. Oh, of course this is a good lap. That is typical. I mean, that wasn't as good as the start of the, the lap I just did, but where am I? Sixth, seventh? These races are actually cracked. So, I feel like even if I hadn't done anything there, I would have still been 7th. But going from 145, 450, from why did you have to click, to 144, 928, that's like half a second jump of it, worth of track experience. Practicing the turns and no when to experience, uh, uh, not experience, no when to accelerate and everything. So, yeah. Hopefully, we're on a traction control free. We have a radar. This does not mean anything at all to me. Well, it does, but I never really use it for daily races. I just do these like sprint ones, the short ones. Sardina, Sardegna, I'm probably saying it wrong. Uh, okay, here we go, here goes nothing. Literally, the start of every daily race for me is just here goes nothing, because anything could happen. This is the most like, unpredictable tier of races. I mean, E's sort of like when you've just started and you're unranked, and then D, you're like, okay, you're still like in this rank. This isn't the very beginning rank. 
then after that I just started to get some more and more challenging to beat times and stuff and to get good but then also hopefully you get more serious drivers who are less bumpy and stuff like that. Right, I'll be on traction control free. Yes we are. Okay. I mean I'll definitely bump into someone. I'm not going to risk that. I have to take it wide there. Oh, that screwed me over. Oh my gosh, that one's already one. <laughs> Where's the stone smoke everywhere? I mean, this Andrea Puma. The exact same thing. Thank you again for ghosting because otherwise I would have actually obliterated him. Don't bug into me please. Thank you. Hope you're not cutting off. Okay, quite far ahead. Position 7. Hoping some of these make mistakes because then I can just kind of ease past them. That was way too quick. Oh dear, I've got to let this person through. Go through. Go through. You are better. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> Honestly, that is karma for hitting me. I saw that. I might have cut them up there. Oh. How am I... My oh, arm looks pretty cool. White, red, black. Silver, red, black. Silver, red, black. I cannot speak. Mit, mit, come here. I'm catching up to you. Oh! Oh my gosh. That one just worn off luckily because it's a quite a eased off race in terms of the race stick. It's not permanent damage, so 98 miles per hour around there, and then I hit that. Great. Still gonna stick for a line there. Don't try another time again, please. That was behind me. I'm gonna stay left. If you want to overtake me, fine. But you've got to go right side though. Now I'm going right side though because I need this for the corner. Oh. I know, maybe I need left side. Seventy miles per hour might have been a little bit too fast. <laughs> this person behind me is so eager to overtake me. I don't want to cut them up though. If you want to go round me, then go ahead, but you're probably not going to have a good time. Also, on the third lap. The game is really trying to do me like that, eh? But I'm sorry, but I had to break there. That is not... I don't know, that, pro that might have been my fault. I'm willing to take responsibility. Honestly, I just saw a red line, I'm pretty sure. And I was like, okay. I cannot use a big turn. Right now, right now, right now, please, 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 please. Okay. Oh, God, so they just got absolutely smacked. I'm, gonna, I'm having to sacrifice my speed just to not hit people. But it is what it is, honestly. Okay. Margaton. Oh, my, that corner felt so much better than theirs. This is probably quite a dodgy place to take there. Literally everyone gets um, drift on the tire. Yeah. I did a 146 at my best, and then the other one was a 158. So, not great. The second one's all right, though. I could have 
accelerated a lot earlier there. Oh dear. That was not worth it. Me and Frankie found out the hard way. That was not worth it. Oh, and that <laughs> three people. Oh no. How am I sick? Is that? I think he's past me. Isn't he? Yeah. Margaretone passed me. He was pressuring me a lot, so I'm glad he did pass me. Well, I'm not glad I lost the position though. But who knows? He might have pressured me to crash me. I feel like he was capable of both taking it, and he. Well, I mean, it was because he did, but... Turn! Turn! Oh gosh. Okay, huh? Oh, now my speed's affected, my turning's affected. Oh dear. I would like to be able to hold P7, but I feel like... The person mum is kind of close to me, but I don't really like it. Damage wear off! Go! Go away! I need this speed back! It's like I've got stick drift, but I haven't. Papiozo, come here. I need to try overtake them. I need to at least try hold out. But then also I want to try and take this person. In a safe manner. That was terrible, that corner. Oh my gosh. Someone's done a 145.437. Is that really the fastest lap? There's no way that's the fastest lap, because I did that in my... I've done quicker than that. I think it's just because it's D-rank, honestly. The fastest lap is pretty new. I mean, like, I'm, I think my lap times are good, but then going to lobby and they're terrible, but then, because I'm in D-rank, they're like, no one's lap times are good anyway, because there's so many people, and, oh, a lot of people ram, and, anyway, I did scuff that up so much, I, one of the, the exits of one of the laps, the first exit, I hit the fence, I went on the grass, did it just like a few people did, but, yeah, speed is not everything. Some places I need to speed up, some places I need to speed down. And yeah, position wasn't the best, but I mean, I, I just gotta let people through, because... Three people quit, two people are still going, okay. So I was... They got a three second penalty. So... I was the number one... UK driver in that race. I'll take that. Someone's still running. The fa how is the fastest lap? That actually doesn't make sense, you know. The fastest lap is the last person still in the race. Because they're not going to have any trouble. They can just... Yeah, they've sacrificed, like, how many positions? Like, 12? But... They're just gonna have a better time because no one's gonna be pushing them off the tracks or anything. <laughs> like me, it's gonna be breaking in front of them. But anyway, that was a daily race B in Gran Turismo Seven. Very interesting. That's kind of that's kind of average for a daily daily race in D rank. That's sort of what I'd expect. I've definitely had crazier, definitely had better. But seventh place, honestly, out of thirteen, that's about halfish. So, yeah. There we go, 8,200, 14 miles, not bad, so yeah, thanks for watching.